made by Rob's son, Andy, and includes uh, the voices of several of his family members as well. And in this video, we'll introduce you to Charlie's father, Pipadit, Lumpadit, and also help you understand the importance of humor in traditional Thai theater and Lique. Um, Charlie really has his father's gift of comedy, which you will enjoy during the play also. So we'll see the video now of Lumpadit. Can comedians themselves communicate the Christian faith? Meet Pradit Sri Bunyang, or Lung Dit for short. Lung Dit joined CCI over 20 years ago. When he first came to apply for work, he had the qualifications. He could sing and play Likke instruments. And he was trained as a Likke clown. There was one small detail, however. He was not a Christian. At CCI, our purpose is to communicate the gospel and to share how Christ has changed lives. The director explained this to Lung Dit. Lung Dit's response was, I want him to change my life. And he asked the director to pray for him then and there. As it turns out, Lung Dit had quite a history. His father was a Likke actor who also was a drunkard and a gambler. As a child, Lung Dit ran away from home in order to escape from him. But Lung Dit didn't escape a life of sin. He turned to alcohol, went through five wives, became abusive, and was a miserable man. A man who somewhere along the line worked as a comedian in a Likke troupe. CCI took a chance and hired Lung Dit. Six months later, he asked to be baptized. In his testimony, he said that the prayer on that first day had been the turning point for him. He left his old life behind. People saw the change in Lungdit and believed it to be a miracle. Before long, his wife became a Christian too. He was elected a deacon in their church, and their son enjoyed growing up within the church community. Lungdit fully dedicated himself to CCI's ministry. He was determined to show what new life in Christ can do, and he put his gifts and talents to use. Besides being a fine actor, Lung Dit was also an excellent musician. When he was not on stage, he would play the renat and the drums. He also taught many young CCI actors how to sing Likke style. <laughs> Likke to Lung Dit was a means of sharing his faith, as well as promoting a Thai art form that he passionately wanted to preserve. Over the years, he has played a variety of characters, including some serious ones, in CCI's contemporary plays. But Lung Dit's biggest impact has been through his humorous roles. When the CCI bus rolls into town, villagers ask for the comedian by name. Many say that he is the reason they come to watch the Likke dramas. He pokes fun at their prejudices and their faults, and points out their need for new life. People love Lung Dit in Likke, but they also love him for his part as Uncle Toad, who plays alongside CCI's evangelist, Uncle Turtle. For years, this comic character has appealed to school children of all ages. But suddenly, Uncle Toad was missing from the performances. Even grade 12 students were distraught. Uncle Toad has visited our school every year since we were in kindergarten. They said, we know he loves us. Where is he? We miss him. Then they and others heard the devastating news. Lung Dit can no longer perform. He is battling bone cancer, and the prognosis is not good. Lung Dit has been in the hospital for many months now. Christ turned this man's life around, and he let people know it, witnessing to ties of all ages. 
entertaining them while challenging them to choose to change. Lung Did has been a true missionary to his own people. We find it hard to imagine CCI without him. CCI has been faced with the sad reality of how to replace Lung Did on the stage. Who could ever take his place? Remember we mentioned that Lung Did has a son? His name is Boy. Now he is all grown up and looks just like his dad. <laughs> Not only that, he's also quite a funny guy. So the good news is that Boy has recently joined CCI. He's taking on his father's roles and carrying on the family Likke tradition. Earlier this year, CCI performed a Likke drama to honor Lung Dit. It gave him a chance to see his own son act in the Likke for the first time. He lay on his cot, surrounded by a host of friends in the audience. When Boy came down off the stage and gave his father a kiss on the cheek, I bet there wasn't a dry eye in the house. It's kind of sad to think about people crying for Lung Dit. He's used to hearing people laugh. I think that when he gets to heaven, he'll hear lots of laughter. <laughs> Those he's left behind will remember him with smiles on their faces. They'll thank God for Lung Dit, the comedian who lived a new life, the funny guy who shared Christ in a special way, through laughter and through Thai Pique. thank my son and his family for producing that. They produced it while Lung Dit was still in the hospital. About a month later, he passed away. Um, but I did want you to know his son, Charlie, or Boy is his nickname in Thai. Real name is Hatsakun. And he has uh, inherited this the genetic ability to do wonderful humor and comedy. And so we're glad to have you know about him. Um, I think they're ready to go with the Lique, so why don't we get started? Uh, we need to just say one or two things about what Lique is like. So Lique always features a hero, a villain, a damsel in distress, a romance scene, a conflict, usually including a sword fight, comic relief, which we've already uh, talked about, and it usually ends with a triumph of good over evil. Now our presentation tonight is an adaptation. Usually Lique performances last two or three hours with lots of audience interaction. Our show tonight is only 35 minutes, so don't, don't worry. Um, and we want to just uh, mention that our, our drama includes domestic violence, and human trafficking, which are current social issues in Thailand. And the way our characters act might be regarded as uh, they are codependent enablers of oppression and violence. But in the Thai context of little institutional support for victims, we encourage you to open yourself to the challenge of faith that they present. We certainly, we are glad for the moves that are being made in Thailand to help uh, prevent violence and, and begin to acknowledge that uh, domestic violence is not okay. It's not something that should be just accepted. But uh, many people are still in situations of um, very few resources. And we have known real life outcomes similar to what you will witness in this evening's play. So without further ado, CCI presents a father's heart and a mother's love.
No one gives. I, I like to be good. 